Hello and welcome to another series of To the Point. Today's topic of discussion is Web 3.0. First of all, let's see why is it in the news. Recently, the term Web 3.0 or Web 3 was mentioned in the news which is being used to describe the potential emergence of the next phase of the internet. Now let's discuss about Web 3.0. The term Web 3.0 was first used by Gavin Wood, founder of Ethereum in 2014. The term is used to describe the potential emergence of the third phase of the internet which would be different from Web 1.0 and Web 2.0. It has the potential to decentralize the internet by using platforms like blockchain technology, edge computing, cryptocurrency, NFTs. It will eliminate the need of intermediaries to enable peer-to-peer -peer interactions between internet users. In Web 3.0, the internet users will have the control over their data, unlike now where tech giants control the platform and the data. The platforms on Web 3.0 will be based on Decentralized Autonomous Organizations that is DOA. DOA will make the rules of the platform transparently available to all users leading to the decentralization of the internet. Now let's discuss about Web 1.0 and Web 2.0. Web 1.0 marks the first phase of the internet from 1989 to 1999, which was a closed environment that is one-way interaction where users could not submit their comments. Web 2.0 started around the late 1990s, which was based on two-way interaction in which users could submit their comments, post and create content like Facebook and YouTube. The current phase of the internet is Web 2.0, which is based on platforms controlled by intermediaries like Google, Facebook, etc. In Web 2.0, these intermediaries control the data and the platform. Now moving on to some other important facts related to it. Blockchain technology is a system of recording information digitally in a decentralized public ledger in a way that makes it difficult or impossible to change, hack or cheat the system. Now it's time for the practice question. With reference to the term Web 3.0 recently mentioned in the news, consider the following statements. 1. Web 3.0 is a new social media platform. 2. It is based on decentralized autonomous organizations. 3. It has the potential to centralize the internet using platforms like blockchain. Select the correct answer using the code given below. 1 only, 1 and 2 only, 1 and 3 only or 2 only. Send the answer of this question in the comment section. Stay tuned for the next episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Dear viewers, watch this topic in Hindi on our Drishti IES Hindi YouTube channel.